to my channel i'm so excited to film this video because i did this video every single year for the past three or four years or something and it's my favorite video to make because i love doing gift guides this is my christmas wish list i hope you guys love this video please don't forget to like and subscribe we are almost at 2k subscribers i want to get to 10k i want to go into 2024 with 100k it's possible honestly but we'll see also i'm gonna close this door because i don't like how it looks <laughs> This is the list for right now. I feel like I'm gonna have to do like different versions of this video and then kind of like give you guys some like other wish list videos or something. Let's get started. Okay, first things first. Um, this one's a bit controversial and I feel like I'm gonna change this, but I really want like a fluffy long robe. I have on my list the Jerf Avenue one, but there's a lot of controversy. So I'm like, no, I don't want that anymore. TNA ankle or crew socks. These are the best socks I've ever put on my feet. I also really love the Swiftwick ones for working out, but the TNA ankle socks are so cute and they're so perfect for literally any day of the week. Like working out every day stuff, like with boots, they're perfect. I'm obsessed with them. Purple wine glasses for my next apartment. This is one of those gifts that like, if I have it, I'm gonna have to keep it here for when I move back to the States and like move into a new apartment. Okay, next is a gel nail kit from gel care this is like a french gel nail polish brand and i'm obsessed with like everything that they do i've never found a brand that does like pearls like they do pastels like they do neons like they do like everyday like really good neutrals so good also i'm so hot road skincare i use road skincare i use their glazing milk i think it's called it's incredible I recommend that one product but i want to try their entire line so that's on my wish list at the minute next is a titanium plated flat iron that's the best for like my textured hair from babyless or bayless however you pronounce it or a chi one i love those brandy melville baby teas the la Occitane bath oil i think it's like an almond bath oil i also have tried their hand lotions and i think their lotions and like any of their little mini sizes would be perfect for stocking stuffers. Next is the Osea Eyeball Roller and Body Oil. The Array Deep Bloat Pills. This is more expensive. Like the Array Deep Bloat Pills are honestly a bit pricier, but people say they're like worth it. So I want to try them. If you know someone who like suffers with stomach issues or something and bloating, I feel like you know when a girl suffers with stomach issues because they always talk about it. Like, another good company is Bye Bye Bloat. And then that one brand from Target. Okay, next are the Navy Blue um chuck 70 <laughs> converse new balance sneakers i have been wanting new balances for quite some time it's like the neutrals um but i don't know if i want those i want those i do but i also want uh these ones i don't know what they're called but they'll be on the screen i, I found these shoes and they were on my wish list before they blew up okay they became popular and they popped off and everyone wants them and everyone has them and i'm like i don't want shoes that everyone has i hate being this way but i am that way <laughs> old school vans I've just been wanting these. I've wanted these for years. I just want them. I think they're so classic. Black underwear sets. Okay, we're all girls here, okay? So it's gonna get a little TMI for a minute. Stuff comes out of a woman's body and you can't help it. But I'll tell you what, it's heartbreaking when you like mess up a pair of underwear that you really love. So I am slowly transitioning from like colored fun underwear to just black underwear and it's that like fit me really good and are so comfortable. There are a pair of hipsters, I think they're what they're called. They're what they're called from Anon that I have gotten sets from. Parade is the second place that I want underwear from because they're so good. Quality of their underwear is unmatched. Like It's breathable, it's comfortable. Like it doesn't get messed up in the wash. I've yet to stain any of them, which is insane. They just last. Like, I digress sweat sets i love the one from mr winston i love their backs what is it called hoodies i love their hoodies okay workout sets i can only do like a good workout if i'm in an actual matching workout set i don't know the science behind it but honestly it's in incredible i'm gonna put a few on screen these are just ones that i've saved on my instagram and i've like looked through their stuff and i've looked through their reviews next is tripods i just broke this one apparently um so i need a new tripod also want one that's like really skinny and tall this one is tall but it's not as tall as i am and i want one that's like six feet and then i want one that like bends to like go over a table just do you know does that make sense like the top of it can bend and so this is a table and my phone can like be parallel to the table and then i want one that suctions to my mirror a workout dress from abercrombie jeans from girlfriend denim i thrift a lot of my jeans and 
while I think that's the best way to like get your jeans, they never fit me properly. So I just want like two pairs of jeans, two pairs of shorts that fit me the way I want to fit, fit me the way I'd like to be fit, fit me correctly. And the next thing on this is shorts. And I've been looking at shorts from a Goldie. Next on my list is Skims. I don't know why I just don't bite the bullet and buy it myself. Honestly, I have no idea why. I've just never purchased it myself. But Skims is on my wish list. It will always be on my wish list. A Henley sleeve dress. I want just like a sleepwear set. The boyfriend sleepwear set apparently is like insane. So I really want to try that. And then I want this bodysuit. I also want to try their bralettes, like the t-shirt bra. Eyelash serum. This brand my cousin recommended me. She uses it and her eyelashes are like naturally long. But you can tell like how much longer they've become since using it. So I really want this one. Nugs. I just want to try this brand. It's um a plant-based chicken nugget brand. But apparently it's like one of the best. So I want to try it. Beeswax chopstick. I was gifted this years ago. Okay. But it is my favorite chopstick. It is so good, you guys. It's truffle hot sauce. This one is a little bit out there. Don't even like hot sauce. But I tried something hot. What was it? I don't even know what it was. I loved it. And I was like, okay. Maybe if I tried like a milder hot sauce with truffle in it. Like, I don't even know if I like truffle. It's like, maybe I would like it. So I just want to try the truff truffle hot sauce just to see like where my taste buds take me you know what i mean anecdote planner and notebook is so good you guys the way that it's laid out is perfect because it has all of the different ways that like different people like to plan out their days or weeks or whatever like you can plan out your week you can plan out your days you can plan out your month all in one notebook and then it has space for notes as well okay a set from aloe yoga i talked about this earlier kind of i want a tennis skirt and tennis top from aloe yoga because i'm trying to get into tennis i feel like if i get a tennis set then maybe i'll want to play more sweater from american vintage i particularly love this pink one and this orange one but i have been eyeing these sweaters for so long i have never in my life seen a sweater and been like holy shit they have the perfect sweaters primark also has really good sweaters but um i want one of these this brand or this sweater hoodie whatever this hoodie is from an instagram brand i have no idea what it's called but the moment i saw this sweater my life was like never going to be the same again. Take my money, like genuinely like make me poor. I sent this to my mom months ago, so I'm praying that she got it for me because I don't want to pay for it. We'll see. American Eagle vintage sports tees, specifically the New York Jets one. I don't know anything about the NFL. I don't know anything about football. I don't know anything about sports, but I do really love a vintage tee. Color sunglasses in this green color, this blue color, <laughs> Or this brown color. Okay, I really want to try the Set Active Buttercup Pointel set, I think. It's like pants, a sweater, and a tank set all together. Buttercup is the color. It's like, <clears throat> oh my god, sorry. Next item is the Mont Blanc Signature Perfume. I sell perfume every year because I love perfume, but I never want to spend money on it. It smells like, like coconut and beach and like sun and like just heaven. I also really want my Katy Perry Killer Queen and my, I don't need cloud actually. I really should have just filmed right here to begin with because this is such better lighting. Anyways, Yuzefi. This brand, you guys, is my favorite designer right now. And the ones in particular that I'm after, I'm just gonna read it off because I don't know them by heart. Large fortune cookie in the magenta suede. Large mochi chocolate suede the yuzefi square mochi and suede blue i've been dying for one of their bags they're stunning next the ninja creamy <laughs> this is something that like is for my future house um but i really want a ninja creamy the road peptide lip treatment um in the color toast so jolie showerhead if you know a girl get her this evan mayhem earrings prize blue and the double knot mixed ones i'm such an earring person and i'm trying to get into like collecting a jewelry collection what curating a jewelry collection that's like really good quality like gold actual gold that'll last me a long time pieces that have diamonds in them or like gems that are really good and that won't tarnish won't fall out whatever i want a blue phone case 
or I just want a blue phone case. Lowell de Janeiro set. I like the original scent, I think it is. Not like the pistachio caramelized macadamia. That one smells like trash. I am sorry, it smells like trash. A Barefoot Dreams blanket. This is again for like my new apartment whenever I move because I already have a Barefoot Dreams in my apartment right now, but I want another one. Silk scrunchies. I have the cheap silk scrunchies from Primark. I think they're trash. Honestly, I need the TLC, the most TLC that I could get in my entire life. I try not to put any type of like clip or anything in here, like a ponytail in my hair because it rips so easily. So I've been just using like these little claw clips. And I also want a curly hair claw clip because they're bigger and apparently they like hold onto your hair a lot more. I have a lot of hair. I have a big hit. So I just need a good quality one. A headscarf for curly hair. I've recently started sleeping with a headscarf. It makes all the difference. I can understand it now. I need one. Heated rollers. I don't even know how they would work on my hair, but I really want to try heated rollers. A hairbrush. I saw this hairbrush on TikTok. It's for apparently like textured hair and it doesn't pull your hair out. I've seen it on white people's hair. I've seen it on fine hair, thick hair, textured hair, and apparently it is just like unbelievable. Some people say it's almost like a wet brush, but then I saw this black girl. She said that on her hair, she used a wet brush and a wet brush works on her hair type. But this one, like, it's better. She's like, if you have been thinking about it, get it. So I want it. I think if I brow and body highlight. You guys, I still have so many to go. Like, oh wait, no, I don't. Almost done. What I want a vlogging camera. This is something that I want to buy for myself, but it is on my wish list. I think the one that I want is like 400 bucks on Amazon and it is a steal. It's a Sony AVF1, something like that. Tennis racket and balls. I want a cute little tennis racket that has an H on it. So a custom tennis racket is a little bit extra, but that's what I want. How cute. Oh, I want an Amazon Kindle gift card. Honestly, you can get such good books on Kindle for free, like in their bookstore. But I've I've collected a list of books that I want to actually buy on Kindle. It kind of pains me to buy them because you spend so much money on them and they're like done in no time and then you're like oh i spent a lot of money on that <laughs> a diffuser this is kind of just for my apartment i want a cute little diffuser to put in my bedroom or my living room and then i want the vine vita number 100 essential oil this one is apparently a dupe for the one hotel scent and everyone apparently goes crazy for one hotel and how they smell i want a custom lighter this is not a necessity. This is something that I just wanted for my home because I thought it'd be really cute. This would be a really cute like coffee table piece as well just to put in a cute little bowl. A suction tripod. I talked about this earlier. But yeah, I want a suction tripod for my mirror when I'm like doing vlogs and stuff in my bathroom. Or Pattern hair beauty set. I tried a pattern product for the first time three days ago, I think. And it is incredible. Linen bed sheets. Again, this is for the new apartment that I'm hoping to move into next year. Um, but I love a linen bed set. I think a cute little bedroom with like my linen bed sheets and like blankets and like pillows would be so cute. On cloud runners. I am trying to get into actually like going on runs. I run at like the gym and I do on the treadmill, but I prefer to do it in nature sometimes because you just get fresh air and like the vibes are good you know what I mean I'm running shoes like my feet kill every single time I do cardio and I really want either some hokas or on clouds but these are the ones I'm aiming more toward Havana slippers in navy <sighs> can I get slippers from old navy for like two bucks yes but do I want the Havana ones also yes do I know why no but I do the Bronte sandal from Liberty London I randomly came across a sandal one day and I love them. My shoe collection honestly just needs improving. I need good sandals that I can wear with like different outfits. I want boots. Oh, that's not even on here. Knee high boots. I also want knee high boots. That's on my wish list. I just need to like build out a shoe collection that like I really love. Because Brandy Mobile Tees, I already said that. Gift cards. I didn't say that. Okay, gift cards. Actually, I'm going to address this one later. Hold on. Blue iPhone case. I think I said that. Suction bag for the iPhone. I don't know what these are called. Octobuddies, I think where it's like a bunch of suction pads. I just want one of these because I film a lot in the bathroom on the mirror. So I think this would be really good for that. Gold and diamond necklace. I really want a necklace that I can wear every single day and not get a reaction. Even if it is a real gold, sometimes I'll get a rash from it. So I want like one of those high, like 18, 24 karat gold with just like a little diamond pendant, maybe like an H, like a super tiny, delicate 
H or something. I don't know, even just like a little circle is fine. Like, I don't know. Next is a tennis bracelet. This doesn't have to be all diamonds, but it, it kind of goes into the fact I want to like build up a stack of bracelets. These are the ones I'm just wearing right now. This is my David Dermot bangle. This is just a bracelet from Italy. And then this is just a little evil eye bracelet that I got from my dad like a long time ago that I don't take off. And I don't ever take off my bracelets, but I want a stack of like gold bracelets to go on my wrist that I don't ever take off. This doesn't have to be like diamonds or anything, but just something really good quality. Next are chunky rings. This ring is from, where is this from? Goriana. And it is my favorite ring at the moment. If you guys can see that, it's just like, okay. Just super cute. And you can wear like dainty stuff on these fingers. I don't know, I just love a chunkier band like this. You know what I mean? Um, I want a gold watch. I found this Australian brand on Instagram and I have loved their stuff for so long, you guys. I, another option that would be really good is this one from Casio. I'm obsessed with them. I just really want like a good watch that I can wear every single day. <laughs> you know last thing on the list actually is papier journal i think it's papier 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 i don't know i don't ever like mix my notebook so i want like multiple which is why i want one from anecdote and from papier oh i was gonna talk about this earlier but it's gift cards and i was gonna say like, you have someone in your family who is like with you right now but they're going overseas or something get them a gift card for the place of the thing that they're asking for that way they can buy it once they're there they don't have to worry about like shipping it and everything i don't know you can make it a whole ordeal whatever you want to do but like taking into consideration the fact that like packing stuff is so hard and it's such a pain in the ass anyways that is my rant and that is my ted talk and that is it for today's video thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys loved this wish list um let me know if there's any rich wish list ideas that you guys would want i don't know like for your dad for your sister your mother whatever um and then i'll link my wish list videos from like the last few years so you guys can see those and get any ideas from those as well thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye